In a part of my life, I had been using cloud services to store my files, mainly iCloud and Google Drive. They were easy to use from any device and very beginner friendly, but the download speed of my files depended on the internet and the provider server. I paid around 10 to $20 monthly for just 2-3 terabytes of space. And of course, I wasn't protected from data leaks or privacy concerns. Don't get me wrong, 2-3 terabytes is plenty, but there's one problem that I'll tell you about a little later. So I thought maybe buying several SSDs and HDDs could help, but no, because to access some files I had to find the right SSD or HDD in my house. And considering I could forget where my files were, I would lose them easily. On top of that, buying multiple SSDs and HDDs separately was quite expensive. Then I thought, what if I could store all my files in one place, which only I can control, and I could use that from anywhere in the world without paying every month. That's when I found the solution, the Ugreen NAS, the most beginner-friendly NAS. This device is basically your cloud at home. It's not only convenient, but also five times faster than the cloud. It can store up to 136 terabyte, which is huge. You couldn't get that kind of storage in any cloud service. Yes, this is a paid sponsorship video, but trust me, I don't accept junk from anyone. Considering my channel is small, I wouldn't want to lose your trust. But this device truly impressed me and I thought it would be a good fit for my content. Now let's try this device honestly and see what it can do. So what's a NAS? NAS stands for Network Attached Storage. To put it simply, it's like your own private cloud. Instead of paying monthly subscriptions to store your files on the internet, NAS stores them locally, on your own drives, but still gives you access anytime, anywhere. The upside is that your data is safe, private and fully under your control. Unlike cloud services, you don't have to keep paying every month. You just pay once for the NAS and hard drives and then use it freely. And you get 5 times faster download speeds. Why do I think NAS is more profitable than any cloud? Well, recently I realized I was paying $10 a month for 2TB of iCloud. I was honestly shocked. If you pay that for 5 years, that's already over $600, and prices could go up with inflation. Eventually you might end up paying over $1000 just to keep your vacation photos from 2017. And after 10 years, you could spend $5000 or more. And that's not even considering the other downsides like company stability, slow speed, or difficulty switching cloud providers. Yes, Google and Apple are huge, but even the stronger servers aren't unbreakable. No one is fully protected from data leaks. Also, imagine trying to download a 40GB folder full of videos. You'll be stuck waiting forever if your internet is slow. And if your cloud gets outdated or too expensive, and you want to switch, good luck transferring 5TB of files. You'll probably end up thinking, it's easier to keep paying for something that's not worth it than to spend a week moving files. So yes, cloud storage is beginner friendly and easy to use, but it comes with serious limitations. But at this point, what if you could fix those downsides while keeping all the good parts? Sounds hard to do, right? But that's exactly what Ugreen NAS does. It's your own cloud, but faster, more secure and cheaper in the long run. My Ugreen DXP4800 Plus costs approximately $700 without discount, but they have cheaper and more expensive options depending on your needs. Adding a few hard drivers or SSD for around $100 depending on how much space you want. And that's it, everything is yours. No more monthly fees, it's more home device, but you can access it from everywhere in the world. The Ugreen DXP4800 Plus that the sponsor sent me is a mid-price option, this in looking and of course compact in size. The craziest part is that it has a lot of ports, including an SD port, HDMI and several USB ports. Which means if you like to shoot videos or photos, you can just toss in the SD card from your camera after filming and store all your files directly on your NAS and use them whenever needed. If you want to use it without any delay, you can plug in a monitor, keyboard and mouse and control it like a PC. It really looks like not only a NAS, but a mini PC thanks to those ports. It also has a 12th gen Intel Pentium and 8GB of DDR5 RAM, which makes multitasking easier. When it comes to its main function, it can handle up to 136TB of HDD and SSD stored with 4 slots for HDD. Each HDD slot can handle up to 30TB while SSD slots can support up to 8TB to 4TB per slot. If you're buying third-party HDD or SSD, Ugreen has a compatibility list, and I'll leave a link to it. The LAN ports on the back supports up to 10GB Ethernet cable and can reach download speeds of up to 1250 megabyte per second, which means you can download 1 terabyte of files in about 20 minutes. For example, let's compare uploading this video to both Google Drive and the NAS. The file is around 1GB, not huge, but enough to notice the difference. And look at this, when I sent it to the NAS, it was done in just a few seconds. 
no waiting, no spinning wheel. Meanwhile, uploading to cloud always take way longer, even when the internet is decent. You can literally see the difference. To connect HDD, I just needed to press the button at the bottom of the slot, pull it out, insert the HDD, and slide the slot back in. I have 44TB HDD, which is enough for now. I installed each of them in the slots easily, no additional tools required. You can also lock these slots to keep them secure. After that, I turn it on. All the indicators lit up. And I went to the website find.ugnas.com. I registered successfully and set everything up. To be honest, the OS of the Ugri NAS looks like Windows, so anyone can use it without problems. It's designed this way so even beginners won't struggle. Everything is simple. Personally, I just followed the step-by-step -step guide of the system and everything was set. Then I configured RAID technology to combine all the storage. RAID has up to 10 versions, each offering different advantages. I choose RAID 5 for balanced performance. The main thing RAID provides is data safety. If one drive fails, your files remain safe and accessible from the others. A huge benefit. Another thing people often overlook is security and privacy. Cloud storages are always at risk of leaks, hacks, or even employee access. But with Ugreen NAS, it's different. It has two international certifications, TUF Etsy N 303, 645, and Trusty, which means it has passed strict privacy and security checks. It also includes a built-in security manager. All your personal data is stored locally, under your control, not on some third-party server. No leaks, no spying. For me, that's huge. Huge. I don't want anyone else accessing my data. After entering the system, I downloaded the Photos app. It allows me to organize albums easily. NASSING has a built-in AI smart recognition feature, so you can search for photos just by typing in keyboards like fruit, pets, or vehicles. It intelligently sorts pictures of people, places, animals, and more. NASSING works on all major platforms, web, iOS, Android, TV, macOS, and Windows. You can watch your films, view recent uploads, and access everything you store it. And the best part is, you don't have to be near the device. You can access it from anywhere with internet and the Ugreen NAS app, as long as the NAS is powered on and connected to LAN. That means you and your family or team can use it anytime from anywhere. So now, the question is, who is this Ugreen NAS for? At this point, we know NAS is basically your own personal cloud at home. All you need is internet access to use it from anywhere in the world. It protects your data from high subscription fees, storage limitations, and privacy risks. All common downsides of traditional cloud storage. So if you're a content creator looking to back up massive 4K projects without risking loss, or if you have a big family and want to store memory safely, or even if you run a small business with a few people needing access to shared data, Ugreen NAS is a solid solution. No more sketchy cloud platforms or endless monthly fees. Just pay once and use it forever. In my experience, Ugreen NAS was a great upgrade. After years of using iCloud and Google Drive as a content creator, I now prefer this NAS. It's faster, safer, and more affordable in the long run. Compared to external drives, it's way more flexible. For me, it's not just storage. It's a full data hub. For example, I like working in different environments. At home, I use my PC to edit large projects straight from the NAS. It feels like a local drive. Sometimes I head to a library or coffee shop for inspiration. So I just send my media files to the NAS, grab my MacBook, and keep working there without any hassle. And when I'm outside or traveling, I can quickly access everything from my phone through the Ugreen app, whether it's photos, videos, or documents. No matter if I'm at home, in the office, or outdoors, all of my files are just one tab away. So yeah, if you want to try it yourself, check the link in the description and use my code for 20% off. The Ugreen NAS, the most beginner-friendly NAS. If you liked the video, subscribe to the channel and take Take care.